Hello everyone, in this video we have this interesting problem. We have 6x to the second power minus 6x is equal to 2x to the third power minus 2. And we have to find the value of x. But before we begin, you know the deal already. Pause the video and try first. And if you are new here, consider subscribed and also don't forget to like this video. Now let's get started. Considering the left hand side of this equation, we can factor 6x out, right? So we have 6x into x minus 1 and this is equal to now from the right hand side we can take two common so we have x to the third power minus 1 right now let's go ahead and then divide each side of this equation by 2 so that these two will cancel this now we have the right hand side to be x to the third power minus 1 then considering the left hand side 2 goes into 2 one time and then goes into 6 three times okay so we have 3x into x minus 1 right now from here I'm gonna keep the left hand side so we have 3x into x minus 1 and this is equal to x to the third power minus 1 could also be written as x minus 1 into x to the second power plus x plus 1 right now what I'm going to do from here is I'm going to move this whole thing to the right hand side, okay? So we have x minus 1 into x to the second power plus x plus 1 minus 3x into x minus 1 and this is equal to 0. Now if you look at this equation very well, you can see we have x minus 1 here. And then we have the exact same thing over here as well, okay? So let's factorize it. We have x minus 1 into x to the second power plus x plus 1, then minus 3x over here, and this is equal to 0, okay? Now simplifying this, we have x minus 1 into x to the second power. Now x minus 3x is minus 2x then plus 1 over here, and this is equal to 0, right? Now let's go ahead and then simplify this further. We have x minus 1 into this quadratic expression could also be written as x to the second power minus x minus x plus 1, and this is equal to 0, okay? So we have x minus 1 over here into, now considering this whole thing, we can factor x, right? So we have x into x minus 1. Then from here, we can factor negative 1 out. So we have negative 1 into x minus 1. And this is equal to 0. Okay? So we have x minus 1 over here. Now let's consider what is in the square bracket. We have x minus 1 over here. So I'm going to write that one. So we have x minus 1. Then we also have x minus 1 here, then x minus 1 here. So I'm going to write one of them. So we have x minus 1 over here, and this is equal to 0. Okay? Now this could also be written as x minus 1 to the third power is equal to 0. Now we are looking for x, so we can take the cube root on the both sides of the equation. Okay? So that this cube will cancel this cube root, so we have x minus 1 over here and this is equal to 0. Now making x the subject from this equation, we have x to be 1 and this is our final answer. So guys, I hope you found this video useful. Please give it a thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Thanks a lot for watching. See you again on the next video and check out this video as well.